What's going on everybody? Welcome to Gmod's World and yes we do have Terrell Pryor Sr. I was able to lurk him and get him for a very very reasonable price. One point something million. I don't know but I'm broke now and I wish I just didn't spend all my coins yesterday trying to buy those packs man. EA really did me dirty but it doesn't really matter about that if you haven't watched the video of me getting done dirty. It's a regular situation. We're going to take a look at his stats really really quickly. Uh, first of all I want to give a shout out to the person that made this card uh, at Dog Pound. What is it, at Dog Pound 40? I want you guys to go to his Twitter and say, yo, G Myers World just shouted you out in his YouTube video because a lot of people don't give credit to people that are creative. And, um, you know, whether or not it's because they're scared that people will, you know, secede them or whatever happens, they just don't. But I've never been that kind of person. If you do something that I think is cool or, you know what I'm saying, you deserve props for, I'm going to give you your props regardless, man. Because, you know what I'm saying, you can't give props when somebody's gone. You know what I'm saying? I always have that mindset. Maybe it's because of where I come from, but yo, the dude created a card with a 6'4 receiver that's 97 speed, 95 acceleration. Now, I know you're probably like, Randy Moss is slower than this. I understand all that, but it's a video game. So we got to take whatever is coming and we got to deal with it. And a lot of the cards have been lower threshold speed. So with, with being able to create this with the mobile blocker and the route runner, that's genius in my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Like, bruh, if you look at the other ultimate tickets, there is no other receiver that's better than this card right now. So I don't know what's yet to come. I don't know, I don't know what other people have made. But as far as what I do, because you guys know I'm the swerve god, I need dudes that are, that are decent height with speed. This is ridiculous for Mutt right here. So once again, I want everybody that watches this video, drop a like and then go hit this man up. Yo, at Dog Pound 40 and give him his props like, bruh. In a year where it's been so hard to get speed with receivers, speed with running backs and all that stuff with all the chems, very, very simple chems, mobile blocker and route runner. You got dudes adding pick specialists and all kind of dumb crap to the cards. This is a logical card based on the way that Mutt is. So I'm going to go ahead really quickly again and show you some of the other cards that are available and let you guys know why I'm disgusted completely. It, it, it's not really anything that's really justifiable, whether the lack of creativity, whatever it is, it, it doesn't really, like Sammy Watkins is a bum. You know what I'm saying? It makes no sense to, to 6 1. He has a 96 speed. He's 6 1, though. You see what I'm saying? Like, so even if you get the route runner and the, you know, the slot expert, that's not adding any speed. So he's just going to stay at 96 speed. You got this guy. How is he a pick specialist on goddamn offense? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just people. It doesn't make any sense. Like, I understand you're trying to get the max speed, but then even when you get the max speed, he goes to 96. And then also his acceleration. You see how low it is? Like, it's. It doesn't make any sense with a lot of the things that's going on, but I understand why people would like B-Marsh. But again, it's trash to me. Uh, Derek Henry, pick specialist and, and mobile blocker to try to give him speed. But it, you know what I'm saying? Like the, they, they, the game has been changed up as far as to where Derek Henry used to be a monster when the game first came out. After several patches, it's not the same thing. You know what I'm saying? So in my opinion, like I said, regardless of what you think and how you feel, it doesn't matter if you like somebody, you don't like somebody. If they do something that you feel is something that should be commended, it definitely should be. And looking at all these golden tickets, you know, even even with Anthony Barr, you know what I'm saying? Like because w even when you max him out, right? Field General gives you whatever. It gives you plus one speed. Uh, Pick Specialist gives you plus one speed. So he's going to be at 95 speed, whatever. If you guys know like I do, after you intercept the ball, your guy automatically slows down. You may be able to roll around a little bit, but as far as the user control with the stick handling, for us old school users, it's been a little bit harder to do it. And I know that they're working on it for Madden 18, so I'm looking forward to that. But that 95 speed, does it's not going to be that much different from the other lower bar card because the speed threshold is very much off in this year. So if you guys are users, you know what I'm talking about. For instance, if you have John Ross maxed out 99 speed, 99 excel, I could tie Lee, the, the regular gold base card would stay with him all the way down the field and swap the ball with an animation. So the speed differentials are really off. And that's why, you know, pretty much with Terrell Pride with the height and speed that he has, if you swerve or do any, it doesn't matter what you do. He's gonna he's the he's the best card you can get for the money right now as far as what's available. So like I said, you guys know what to do. Dog Pound Forty on Twitter. Like the video. We're about to get some gameplay in with Terrell Pryor Senior. I'm gonna see you guys and girls next time. One love.